Welcome to another AWS Unlimited match. Today's match is going to be the Smiling Friends, Charlie Dombler, and Pim, that's right, I almost said Piff, Pim, <laughs> Pim Pimley versus Joe Gatto, and Brian Quinn, that's right. I, uh, the Bobby Q, I remember his full name, Alf. The Barba Q himself. The Impractical Jokers, and they will be fighting in a Tornado Tag Team match. I am your host, Super Duper Zachary Thunder, Super Duper -E -E you know, the whole shebang. Where, Where are you people? Where's Prince Herb? Captain Communist. Oh, uh, little See, Murr and Sal Joker's decided to sit this one out because it was a, it was a, uh, it was only a Joker versus Joker challenge. The challenge is to see who can beat these guys faster, Joe or Q. And what, oh. What's the punishment if they lose? You don't want to know. Oh, wow. Uh, the frowny friends. friends. You they have to deal yeah, with the frowning friends? No, 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 worse, 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 worse. The Renaissance Man. Fuck! That's good. You know, yeah, that's what Rice said. You were the Renaissance Man. <laughs> the Renaissance Man. You do the Renaissance Man if you lose. That's their punishment. Oh, oh no. Oh, no. And as for Smiling Friends, they're just... Uh, the, you know, they, uh, they had, they, they got... They had to make the audience smile. That's it. Hey, that's, hey. Are you saying me, Philip the Douglas Chilp, doesn't make the audience you see, smile? see, what happened was that Mr. Boss, an audience member of ours, like all of our audience members, complained that they weren't smiling enough at our show. So Mr. Boss sent these guys to make the audience smile. You know what? That's actually a wholesome cause. I'll get uh, that. Michael! Michael! You prankster. That's not making anybody smile. Michael. Uh, I mean, it is his show, so I mean, what can we really do about it? True. True. Look at these units walk around. Oh my god, Joe's gotten orange. Yeah. And jacked. Yeah, whenever whenever they first got hired onto uh, AWS Unlimited, the the Jokers decided they're gonna hit. Not only were they gonna start hitting the uh, unlimited gyms, the unlimited branded gyms, they also uh, took a little bit of the uh, Super Duper Soldier Serum, if you know what I mean. Oh no, they've been yeah. yeah. Say, <laughs> I can't believe Joe became Mister Douchebag from your favorite Martian. Which I mean, to be fair, I don't think we. Like we've said before, juicing's not really outlawed in our show. Well, yeah, so, we do a lot worse than juicing on our yeah, show. Yeah, nothing's outlawed in our show. Yeah. Honestly, I think either of these teams could uncrown the Joker gang finally. Granted, I think anybody who would actually challenge the Joker gang could decrown them, but that's not the point. We'll see. Whoever wins this match might have just a little bit more confidence in themselves. Whoever loses that they could this be match will be tonight's game. biggest loser. And yes, whoever loses oh. will be tonight's oh. big loser. I mean, heck, one of the teams is named Joker. In fact, you know what? You know what? I just got word from Michael Television just now with with his telekinesis. Yeah, he has that. Apparently. I just thought he had a Bluetooth. Yeah, I was going to say, that's usually how it goes. But <clears throat> but uh, anyway, so uh, Michael just now decided that instead of the punishment going to uh, the Joker who takes the longest to win, it's going to go to whichever team loses straight up. I didn't know Michael was in charge of the hit television series and Practical Jokers. No, he's making, a, he's making this a stipula stipulation for the match, too, now. Oh. And, but Michael's in this case, it's whichever team loses, the deal with the Renaissance, Renaissance Man is punishment. Kami, have you ever dealt with Michael Television? No. I have no time. Oh, well, that's good. That's good. You never, you never dealt with Michael Television? We've been dealing with him for, like, the entirety of last season. <laughs> Excuse me, you have been dealing with him the entire last season. I he, made the, he made the universe glitch! I literally have pawned off anything I've had to deal with that man on to you. Oh, wait, you used to have... Wait, wait, you used... So you have history with Michael Television? No, so I'm saying I have. To, what I'm saying is, I don't give a, f a rat's ass about that man. And uh, quite honestly, Ow. I find it rather offensive that you keep bringing up Michael's name, considering I don't even give a shit about my own children. Well, Michael's the the boss of this of Unlimited, so yeah. Well, that's, that's Michael, <laughs> you can take my finger and shove it up your bum. Do you know? Do you Obvious know? challenging Michael Television. I will throw down with Michael right here, live on AWS Unlimited. I will take New your cheeks feud. and part it like Moses did the Red Sea. New feud here on Unlimited. Oh, it looks like. So, is that an actual challenge you're giving to Michael for a match? Absolutely. All right, Michael Television. Oh. Um, will he respond? We don't know. We'll, we'll see what Michael's response is to this challenge to a match we just now randomly got. I, I hope he responds quicker than Alpha Chat's been to whether or not he'll fight Wolfgang. Look He's probably going to respond in three, two, one. Oh, uh, I just got word Michael uh, Michael accepts it. Sure. Wonderful. That wasn't Michael. Oh, yeah, that was me having a stroke. Sorry about that. I sound nothing like that. Why are you rushing? That was a typo! <laughs> It's because Michael's Michael Television's natural voice is the voice of Christopher Lee from Charlie and the Chocolate Factory. But he's British. I, 
I didn't do Russian. Sounded you Russian. Thought it was Russian because you're terrible with accents. That's why. Or maybe Michael just has a bad Russian. Holy! Accent. Oh! oh! Him breaking cues. Oh! Belly. Oh. And now Charlie, Damn. he's thinking about diving, but he's afraid of heights. What's he gonna do? Charlie, go for no. He's waiting for him to get up. Oh, okay. okay. No, Charlie's gonna. Oh! oh. Double. Oh, I just got punched. First by balls. Joe. What a pay. A lot of gut shots in this uh, match. A four seven. A forty seven. Also, I gotta say, Zach, uh, <laughs> being up? at a WWE like live recently, this would be very weird to see in person. Yeah, and especially yeah, so yeah. I guess Why we went from real life. Yeah, we saw Raw live, and um, yeah, it would be it would be rather it'd be rather unique seeing these particular people fighting in that ring Phil, in real how life. Are you not the band? <laughs> Going to WWE <laughs> matches. Yeah, I was actually going to question that myself last night. We were there. And how'd like, you get in there? Uh, you see. Yeah, come on. Uh, yeah, I sn I snuck all we had to do was get a little Don't dimension popping, and, and there we go. Oh, uh, so you went to alternate dimension WWE? Yeah, the one where uh, the universe isn't fucked up. Oh, it's a weird. Much. It's a weird timeline. Yeah. Instead, just the economy's fucked up. Oh, fair. Um, so, <laughs> so you just went to real life. Yeah. Social I commentary. Mean, yeah. Dimension six nine. Yeah, I just snuck in because I'm a cucumber and we're small, so I can just get into. So you didn't even have to pay for tickets. Yeah. Son of a bitch. I got the best seats in the house because nobody knew I was there. The only the only person who's gonna know I'm there are people at home watching on TV who are be, who are gonna look at the TV and be like, "Is there a fucking cucumber next to the barricade right there?" Well, the it must have it must have edited you out or something. Better you by the they, camera. They edited, me, they edited me out in rerun their versions. Live, li live, I'm still there. That's oh, sad. Yeah. yeah. You have to watch. Oh my god, Q with the starter. Stone Cold Kevin Owen shades of. And the oh, Joker's wow. won. Oh, wait, Pim's eliminated. Yeah, Pim's eliminated. Yeah, Char eliminated. Can Charlie what are Charlie and Joe doing to each other? Um, yeah. I, I think you might. Oh, okay, okay, yeah, that's censored. Yeah, that's censored. They're, oh, just, a move. They're, just, okay. they're just being good friends. Smiling friends. <laughs> I, I still had to put the sensor over that because my pants fell down, and uh, yeah. Joe has a knack for having his pants fall down, though, to be fair. Yeah, but Charlie's too. And his shirt. More so his shirt, but his pants every so often, yeah. And the Joker's, and the Joker's sweep win the smiling this match friends. here on Unlimited. Man, the smiling friends, they may know how to make us smile, but they aren't the best fighters. Alright, good match is over. I gotta go poop. Alright, see so you As Rai goes take a shit. Rye's gonna No, go that's on an audience member! No! Oh, God. Why, Rai? Why? Why is this always happening in our, in our, in our, in our place? I think that's the first there's time we've had an audience member actually get shit on. There's always something absolutely disgusting happening in our place. And you're always the one pointed out, too. I don't know, man. Why not, why I'm not the one who told Rai to shit on the you audience. Why just let me and our audience live a blissful existence of not knowing that this disgusting... Just gross shit is happening in our in our arena and just not mention it. But no, you have to point it out every single time. Because you have to. Because you think it's funny. Oh look, he's, he's poopy. Poopy poop. I'm Philip Fang Chillip. And I like poop. Douglas. Well, you know what? I'm Captain Douglas. Douglas. And this has been oh, a pretty awesome. dandy episode. Y'all have a fucking fantastic Wait, yeah, we episode. It's not done yet. Yep, yeah, we have to we have see to the star rating. Finish. Especially with the Joker celebrating. Uh, this match was rated by Rob Walker. Three and a half stars. Great. Okay, that's good. Okay. Awesome. Now you Michael didn't give the rating? That fucking piece of garbage. He owes me 20 bucks. You'll, 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 you will figure this out with Michael. And a winner a, gets a 20 bucks match. Anyway, whether you like it or not, that has been the match. I've been your host, Super Duper Zack of Thunder. I've been filled with the Douglas Chilp. And this man has been Captain Communist. And Rai is actually taking a shit. And challenge accepted.